Hello guys, welcome to Octocoder. In this video lecture, we are going to learn how to send email through the Node.js using the Node Mailer packages. So let's get started. So here is the Visual Studio code. I have created one folder on my D drive email code. I'm going to show you all from the basics. So first we need to initialize the project. I hope the font is good. Okay, mail sender. Let's give the package name mail sender and then version one. Okay, description node.js email send integration. A little description, whatever you can give it. Entry point index.js. Uh, okay, no problem. Test command, nothing. Git repository, nothing. Keyword, nothing. Author is octocoder okay let's say yes and that's it guys we got our package here see this is our package so we don't have the dependencies here so we need to add the node mailer package here inside the package.json so for that we have to install the node mailers so here is the node mailer official website and here is the node mailer installation command you can copy this command or you can type it here npm i node mailer and hit the enter and you will see here you will get the dependencies added on this package see we got this node mailer package here 6.9.2 version current version is right now it is the may 2023 version in the future might be changes so we got the all files here so let's create here a new file index dot js and i'm gonna minimize this one this one i don't need it right now so first we need to import the node miller module inside the node.js application so for that const const node miller equal to require node miller so we imported the module here so now we need to create the transporter object object using the node miller they have provided the method for that create transport this is the method using this method we need to create the objects of smtp transport so first is the service so here we need to give the which service provider you we are going to use you can use here gmail you can use here yahoo mail etc so i'm going to use in this example gmail service provider and then here we need to give the authentication of your gmail account so for that i'm going to give my octacoder gmail account is a uh, octacoder for your information at the rate gmail.com this is a octacoder gmail id and then you have to write here the password for this octacoder so the password we need to generate this password i'll show you that password how to generate that password the for now i'm going to to write this uh, blank just for now i'm going to show you which password we need to use here i'll show you all the step by step so don't worry about that this is just for temporary and now we have to set up the email data so here is the late mail options we need to create the object here for the setup and this object is like uh, you can see here this object like this is the this is the same object we need to provide the two whom you are going to send and subject and this message so see this, these three lines and one is the from these lines we are going to write here that is the setup nothing else guys and we need to provide here information setup is the same octa coder email id and two whom you want to send let's write it my own id for now and then subject what subject you are sending here so testing node mailer you can give whatever you subject you want to give and here the text what message you want to send it let's give it uh, welcome to octacoder please please subscribe octacoder youtube channel for learning web development 
so that's long message <laughs> so we created the mail option also here and the last step is we need to send the email now so for that we need to create here the transporter object so let's create transporter dot send mail is the method using the transporter object we are going to send the email it takes the mail option as a parameter and then the callback functions we can write it here as a error and info for that callback functions and then the creating the object if the error throws then we will print message console dot log error error occurred and if it is successful then we will print console.log email sent to whom we are going to send so for that mail option let's take the two then you can write info.response this information for the developer so that's it guys we done all the code this is the just uh, 25 lines code nothing else so now i'm going to show you the password we need to provide here so which password we are going to provide there so go to the your gmail account and here just click on the manage your google account and then you will go redirect to the this security and privacy personal account in the left side you will see the options personal information then click on the security option this is the fourth option of security click on this security option and you will get lot of option here you will see lot of option here but we need the app generator but that app generator is not located in here so so we here we have the inside the how you sign into google inside that first option is the two-step verification option we got that option so click on that option after clicking on that you will need to provide the password give your password and then you will redirect to the two-step verification page here here we need the app password see in the last option is the app password so click on this app password so here give it a mail and it's not for the anything so here let's click other and give the name node.js mailer so when you click on this generate password you will get the 16 digit password pop up so let's see let's click on this password and see so we got this 16 character password so copy this password and let's click on this done and go to the your visual studio code and inside the password inside this we have written the star star and here paste that password and save this file and now let's check the our code is working or not so let's open terminal and node index.js i hope everything is fine so let's run this code enter and see guys email sent to octacoder for your information let's check our gmail the successful happen and see we got the testing node mailer i sent it myself the <laughs> email see we got this whatever we have written here and that's it guys the node mailer functionality is successful if you want to send me the mails to you so you can give, comment on your email address i will send this whole code to you on your gmail so which is also testing <laughs> you can give it your email address comment down below your email address i will send this whole file you just need to add the install the dependencies you can do that if you are learning the node.js so you know how to install that that's it guys so here here you can use the html text also instead of text here you can use html and then you can write this comment inside the h1 tag hello welcome to octacoder h1 tag is close and then please subscribe to octacoder youtube channel and we will provide here a link of octacoder anchor tag inside the anchor tag href we got the error it's because of the blank spaces 
so remove that blank spaces and so here let's give the octocode a youtube link so let's copy this link from this you can subscribe guys you can watch the all videos here octocoder youtube channel we have uploaded lot of videos about the node.js text editor how to create the glowing buttons and javascript some um, there are a lot of videos on please subscribe the octocoder youtube channel and then give that link here save this file and now let's run this again and successful is email sent to octocoder let's check the octocoder gmail account and see <laughs> i'm sending myself <laughs> And see we got the heading one welcome to octocoder this is paragraph and we got the also link here if you click on this link it will redirect to the octocoder youtube channel so that's it guys if you like this video please subscribe to the octocoder youtube channel and don't worry about this code i'm going to upload this all code on the octocoder github account you can see the we have also the octocoder github account you can check on this link here on the banner you can see the octocoder youtube or you can go to the about and here we have the github link so that's it guys if you like this video give it a thumbs up and share this video to your friend and don't forget to subscribe thank you guys thank you for watching